Oh, you were saying why does your job look? It's Wait. not traditional. But to, to one is like, what do you I don't... mean you're not your job though? You said that. Like the same way that the person I am at home, like when I'm not the two pussy princess, when I'm chilling and relaxing and having a nice time and not having to think about like how I look on camera, what people are gonna think of me, what I have to say, they're not the same person. I, she's actually kind of nice sometimes. And like, do you know, like, that's the person I want to be loved but and I want someone to love. I don't give a toss what people think about the two pussy princess. Yeah, hate me, love me. I've got a cool party trick, I have two vaginas. But like, the real person that, what was like, the person that I am outside of it because it's not all real that's the person that wants to be treated like a lady that wants a door held open for sorry that wants a door held open for her that wants to be loved and wants a man to embrace her and make her feel special and do you think that oh my God. you you had something go ahead I just I, I I guess I'm trying to reconcile how you commodify something and sell it mm -hmm. and then it's something that does directly infringe into your personal life because I would say your body is your personal life. I mean, it's like acting. But but it's not like acting. I mean, it's act, act, I feel like acting is very different than can, what we're talking can about. Can I chime in? Um, I understand completely what she's saying. And I just feel like society makes it hard for people to differentiate between a person and their career or their mm. job. You know what I'm saying? I get it, but you, if you don't want to date someone who, you know, is a any other profession, the ha you know, it, it's kind of like that's the hazard pay. Is someone might not, you know, it's it, there, I, I didn't a, say that. I didn't say like I understand at the end of the day, my job if they've got a problem with it, they've got a problem with it right, and they don't have to date say. me. What I'm saying is that the two pers like the Annie Charlotte, my life that I live that's not the girl I want people to love. The girl I want people to treat me right and make me feel special is the girl that isn't on camera. But I understand. No, These I are not disconnected loved. things. Yeah. What's difficult about it in- They in, are. Out, out, How? Because they're two completely different, like it's like two completely different personalities. But I mean like the qualities you have do play into the type of job that you get. So it's like, I mean, you are. Oh no, I can't. I can't well, I could have that. gone into something I else. I just wanted to go into this. I could like. I could have done a different job. Um, I just find it hypocritical to want to have all the benefits of a traditional man. While I'm not so glad I'm not dating. Donated one hundred dollars. I am not my job. <laughs> Derek Chauvin should have used that argument in court with your logic. <laughs> wow. Hmm. Well, I mean, he's making a good point. Hmm. He's making a good point. Like you can't just disassociate yourself, the person from the job. The person is in the job, they're still the person. I don't think he made a good point at all because he was on duty when he did what he did. Yeah, so but he's still the person. He's, but that, are you not on, on duty when you're making OF content? But that's not what she said though. She said when she's not on camera, when she's not doing content, and when I, she's not making I videos. think everyone, regardless of what you do so for it's work, different. it deserves love and deserves a loving partner. But I think it's unrealistic to expect to be treated in a traditional way while not carrying yourself in a traditional way. I, I just mean, find that very hypocritical. No, I, 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 I don't dis like I disagree with your opinion because like we just talked about, there are women who are untraditional and they still get traditional treatment. So it's not unrealistic. It's just rare but you I even stated you don't want long term right i don't but doesn't mean that's mm -hmm. not going to change right just because Sorry. i don't want a but long term a relationship doesn't mean i don't want a man to treat me with traditional treatment but there is, it doesn't mean i don't want a man but, to but there is something me. that got that 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 men if you're looking for a guy to treat you traditionally there is something that they're investing in they're investing in a relationship you know it is but an investment hold on let me finish no, my right. it's reciprocal mike davis donated 100 dollars Brian, not gone lie, we run that back. I'm letting you get mauled and I'm pulling out the popcorn too. I like big girl BC, we know she's a platinum Burger King costumer. She put spread in my pocket dot gratitude. <laughs> Sorry, Mike. I, I hate to break it to you, but I do not eat Burger King. That is not where I go. Chick-fil-A and Wendy's get all my money, baby. What if it's Sorry. a Oh, that Babies. was such a banger comment, though. Disgusting. <laughs> Burger King is disgusting. Okay. Well, 
please don't insult Mike Davis's. <laughs> I'm not insulting him. I'm He's, insulting. I'm, didn't he just food. buy you a truck? He didn't buy it. He didn't buy it. Oh, okay. <laughs> if he that did, would he eat it? Look, uh, in support. <laughs> <laughs> but look, I mean, look, it, do, doing like having nude photographs of yourself out there, sleeping with other men for work, porn. It's not traditional. Right, we're it's not. not dis- I'm not disagreeing well, she's, with she's that. Well, she's saying that there's well. It's, I'm, I'm not that's saying that. Oh, well, well that's, actually, I that's the that. basis of the conversation. No, I, I really Here. wanted her well, to finish yeah, no. her point though, because oh, she was. Was there more? Oh, you're yeah. right. You're right. Go ahead. Something. Continue. Yeah. Continue. Yeah, it, it, I was just saying that it, building up to the point of there's something reciprocal in relationships, and if you're looking for a traditional guy, I promise you that that reciprocity and what they're investing into in time and money in paying for a date and you know it, it, it's 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 all reciprocal and it's different if you're a non-traditional guy versus a traditional guy what you think you're investing in versus Tracy on tilt donated one hundred dollars which girl I don't mean to be rude with my questions oh I am merely curious with the choices you made and why I pray you find God in the meantime, don't put a spell on me, please. <laughs> oh. I, just, ha, ha, love I, I, I just do light magic, sweetheart. I don't, I don't do black magic. <laughs> All right, thank you, uh, thank you, Tracy. Uh, go ahead with your. And point. and so, Pat, like, where was I? The reciprocity is kind of what I was getting to, but really, it's like ever, you know, if if love's what you want, then love's what you go for it. I guess the point here is, it 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 changes what guys are willing to put into a relationship for people who are living traditionally and right. not going down non-traditional paths. And that's not even a judgment on either one. It just, what it does is it creates an environment where all guys, you know, all guys are bad guys. They don't want to put the effort in. They don't want to pay for the first date. You know, I think that the nice guy trope is, 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 is sad because I think that guys have a <coughs> biological tendency Chuck to want to trapped do that. in the fishnets donated $106.69. What? Alexis looks like a high school dropout, fatherless, alcoholic, low budget stripper, but I would still smash for show and hit from the back, even toe the back shot wins. Prally smell like sea what world. The fuck? <laughs> I don't think I understood that. <sighs> <laughs> I, Shark I appreciate the, the silence from everyone. The Meg lives on. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, they really like to interrupt you with the TTSs. Did you have uh, more? They do. Well, I feel like I need to wrap it up now because they're, they're, <laughs> they're coming they're in. Yeah. You, yeah. No, it's really just that I, I think stuff that I think of is how it actually affects like a traditional path. And I feel as though guys, you know, even if they are looking for a traditional woman, they look less. They, they I, I feel as though they're less apt to put it, you know, put that value and put the time in if they think that it's just going to be turned into some short-term thing and it's mm-hmm. not going to be a long-term thing okay well so can uh, i i, I want to dive in on this real quick on the you hate me <laughs> <laughs> yes i i do but anyway the, the, so the yeah i get it all the time all right so the how how does a guy disassociate like okay he wakes up in the morning and he pours his coffee and he's like <laughs> i'm gonna go to work honey and you're like yeah i'm gonna go f- dudes like how would he disassociate you, the girl with the dream weaver, you know, in the background, from the you who goes and gets like, you know, double v- hump during the day. Like, how do you how do you get away from this? I don't know. I haven't met him yet. Um, and I hope I do. Like, but the thing is, not yet, because I'm so not ready to settle down. I'm like, I'm in my like technically prime of my career. I'm gonna be. Can somebody just? Says, I'm not my job. I've heard so many 304s go on about how they love being violated, thrown around, and used as rags. Don't fool yourself, redhead. Oh, okay, thank you. Mm-hmm. Don't fool yourself, redhead. I do like that, yes. Um, <laughs> really? I do. Who doesn't? Am I supposed to, am I supposed to not want um, that? I, I personally don't like being but that's just me. Oh, no, actually, like, <laughs> sorry. I don't mean, like, I want to be. I mean, in the sense in the bedroom. You want me to read it, Brian? Uh, uh, this is a uh, no. Oh, okay. Um, I um, yeah, I like to be thrown around in the bedroom, but I also like to be. Why can't why can't things be separate? Like, why can't I want a nice guy to like the other me and do my job, and then also have nice intimacy that sometimes can be rough and sometimes can be nice. Like, you can like 
both. I don't really understand why, because I set, because I do my job. I, I didn't really understand that comment. What were they well, trying to still, say to still, me? They're still diving in on the disassociation. So they're just saying, how do I, how does, how does anybody disassociate you because from the, from the fact that you say, well, this is just a job. It's like, okay, I get it that you think of it as just a job, but how do I disassociate you, the person, from what it is you do? Like, well, think, you Bob the Builder, the right? Me. He's Bob but you the get, Builder. But you and you're get like, to know girl, the, the only fan. You know what I mean? But you get to know the actual me, because obviously the online personality that I have isn't the real me. Like, the, the home me that, like goes on dog walks every day and loves my mum unconditionally and cries all the time sometimes. Yeah, but those are all aspects of you. Yeah, that I don't show online. Yeah, but those other things are also aspects of you. Yes, but they're two different, separate, like the one they're is They're not a separate, they're both you. Well, they're, they're, they are though, because when you get into this kind of industry, it's not like you put your full self out there. There is a second, there is a second, you have to, you have to have a second skin. Being online is so hard. You have to take all the like mean comments, all the everything. Nobody else is having sex but you, right? It's you, you're well, doing two, that. So technically one can do yeah, that yeah, and the other but one doesn't it's have you, to. And then, so and then, then it's, maybe. It, yeah, I'm just saying no. it's you and then it's also you. It's still you. Yeah, I, can I, yeah. I, see what, I, I see where you're going with it and I understand. But I think what she's trying to say is that when we log on or when we make our videos and things like that, it's a fantasy that we're selling. So in our mind, because this is a job, this is something that we're doing to get paid, that's not all that we are. You know what I'm saying? To people out here, I that's agree. what we are to them. But, you know, when, like, yeah, when we agree. have conversations like this, we say, yeah, we're not just that. We're not just our job. That's the point. Yeah, I, under I understand to what you're saying there, too. You're saying, look, um, there's other aspects of me besides just this type of sex work that I do. Right. I get it. <clears throat> But you also have to own the fact that it's also you doing the sex work. No, yes, I, I agree with you. I, yeah, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not disagreeing that. that. I'm not disagreeing that. I'm trying to ask a man to completely dissociate them. But I am asking for like, he's got to accept my job. At the end of the day, it's not going to work out. But I am asking for him. Not every time he look like I'm asking for the respect you get doing your job. As you just said, no one's going to love us. No one's going to respect us. But. I'm just saying the at home me yeah. that sits down and sits for a movie with my partner, that she wants some respect. She wants some love. And that was all I was saying. Can I interject? But I mean, it's the truth though. A lot of these guys, they don't um, care what a whore has to say. You know, it's the truth. Like they don't care. So even if you spill your guts, when, when, when they watch this, they're going to be looking like, shut your whore up. Yeah, you know? So it's like, okay. at the end of the, I'm, I mean, it's the truth though. They yeah. don't care because we are the tainted meat and they see us as lower than, you know, I see people comments. I read through a lot of stuff and they don't care that you want to be loved when no. you go home. You know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, you already mm -hmm. have to come to that realization oh, yeah. and say, I don't give a shit. Well, that, yeah, I feel yeah. like that's definitely true. But, but isn't their like motivation actually for reformation? So since it's for, like to what? the motivation of shame is usually for reformation. So the motivate now mm -hmm. there's just some people who are just fucking mean. I agree, right? There's just some mean people yes, out yes, there. Absolutely. But I think for the most part, shame has a place in society is trying to reform people out of behavior mm -hmm. that it, that's you would true. prefer to not see. Correct. Right? right? Yeah. And so if the social shame, always the stigma is towards the sex work. Isn't that a form I mean, of social reformation? It, though, what about the people who do want to see it? I mean, y'all speaking on yeah, everybody I get who it. dislike it, but there's not going to be. Yeah, but they're trying to shame those people too. She, they, that's well, fine. They, but but that stuff's been like since. I like to get yep. onto the point of it's been since. Uh, 